My name is Dai Long from Computing Architecture Laboratory, NICE, Japan. Uh, this is a brief introduction about our research with the title A Low Complexity Strong Encryption Modulation Method for IoT Sensor Transceiver, published in MDPI Electronics. And this research was supported by GFPS Kakeni brand number gp sitting k 18105 here is the outline of my short introduction let's start with the background as you may know that recent years internet of things becomes very popular and plays an important role in many applications such as smart home smart grid smart healthcare uh, this motivates researchers to investigate a variety of issues in IoT applications. Most of the IoT applications rely on the wireless connections. It made the uh, transmission vulnerable to attackers. Moreover, many transmitted data are private or confidential information. That's why we need to enhance the security of the IoT connections. However, the challenges come from IoT sensors. We have a limited on the power resource and computational ability. They cannot execute heavy traditional cryptography algorithms. And that's why uh, we need to develop low complexity security algorithms for IoT sensor transceiver. Uh, based on the idea of developing low complexity encryption methods that do not change the constellation modulation and using its all operations, uh, we propose new continuous positive IP and PB values for its modulation times. As a result, we can employ the is operation to encrypt the IP and QP value. Uh, based on the above idea, we propose the GAM methods that merge the operations of the mapper and encryption into one component. The encryption is divided into two states, named pre-map and uh, post-map. The is all operation is placed uh, between the remap and postmap. The detailed algorithms of the GAM methods is executed in three steps. The first step is the remap, the second step is the it all operation, and the third step is the postmap. We evaluate the GAM method both in the performances and in the hardware complexities. The simulation results show that the proposed methods preserve the bug and per performance of the system. For the hardware comparisons, we designed the GAM and conventional methods in uh, Verilog. The hardware architectures of the GAM method consists of only multi blessers and XR operations. The hardware synthesis on the FPGA and AGIS show that our proposed method consume low FPGA shocks, AGIS area, and power compared with the conventional method. So, do some security analysis to prove the security of the proposed methods. And the security of the GAM is guaranteed because it is a time of the phase encryption and it encrypts all bits of the transmitted data. From the above evaluation results, we can conclude that the GAM method does preserve the bur and per performance and significantly reduce the hardware complexities that can be applied for IoT sensor transceivers. For the future work, we continue to reduce the complexity of the decryption method. Thank you for your watching. For more details, please accept the above link of the MDPI electronics.